Hey everyone out there, welcome to another episode of Uncensored Solar TV brought to you by my amazing team here at Solar Wolf Energy. Today we are talking about portable solar. I don't know if you guys have seen these things, but it can either be a trailer where it might unfold and have maybe 20 or 30, even 40 solar panels on it and provide temporary power. Kind of a good idea. I I think there's a problem with that though, depending on what you're trying to power, it may not provide enough. I think with the adaptation of certain solar panels being far more efficient, like a sun power and LG or something, this probably makes a little more sense. But as we go on, as we all know, in our industry, year after year, we're getting more and more efficient and uh, we're getting closer to a commercial grade perovskite, which would allow, uh, obviously, we pat blow past 30% efficient. That would be huge. This would make a 40 panel trailer on a temp uh, after disaster relief and things like that, coupled with a battery. This makes a really, really good point. It's something that we'd like to keep an eye on and we're excited to see how this can grow. Um, on the other side of things where you guys might've seen where there's, I think it's like a Jeep or something online where they basically pull out a huge roll. It's like rolled up, right? It just pulls out a roll of it and you just temporarily put that in the field. Again, I see these things as like after a hurricane or a tornado disaster area, right? Where there's a state of emergency, there's no power lines. This being a concentrated effort for electricity given on demand where needed for, you know, temp hospitals and things like that. This may be the way, this may be the future. Obviously we don't have generators running, requiring fossil fuels and polluting the air with CO2. This might be something incredible. So um, we look forward to that and the growth of this. And if you guys have any comments, links or anything else, something similar you wanna talk about, please drop a comment below. We'd love some feedback on that. And uh, this is a space we're watching because we hope this could take off and this could actually be a, a small subset within an industry going forward to on a global scale for a lot of the, uh, the disaster relief efforts. So with all that, thank you for watching another episode here of Uncensored Solar TV brought to you by my amazing team here at Solar Wolf Energy. Thank you.